Welcome everyone to week two of virtual worship. Uh, we're very happy to have you all tuning in and uh, just invite you to worship along with us this morning. So take this life. Take this life forever, I will call it yours. Take this life, you're the one I'm living for. Yes, I give it all to you. I give it all to you. Love so great. Love so great. You taught my heart to beat again. God, your praise will ever be upon my lips. So I give it all to you. Yes, I give it all to you. Because your love is better. Your love is better than life. Better than life. Better than life. And your love is better than life. Give it all, give it all to you. So I give it all, give it all, give it all, give it all to you, to you, to you. I give it all to you. So your hands held high. Your hands held high. I surrender everything I have. At your feet, I'm finding everything I am. So I give it all to you. I give it all to you. Oh, your love, cause your love is better than life. Better than life, it's better than life. So I give it all, give it all, give it all, give it all to you. So I give it all, give it all, give it all, give it all to you, to you, to you. I give it all to you. You're so much more. You're so much more than I could ever hope for. Yes, there's so much more than I could ever hope for. Oh, you're so much more than I could ever hope for. God, you're so much more than I could ever hope for. Because your love, because your love is better than life. It's better than life. Your love is better than life. Better than life. It's better. Sing your love. Your love is better than life. Better than life. It's better than life. Sing your love is better than life. Better than life. It's better than life. So I give it all. Give it all. Give it all, give it all to you. So I give it all, give it all, give it all, give it all to you, to you, to you. I give it all to you. Oh, we give it all. Oh, we give it all. praise. Let our praise be your welcome. 
come, let our songs be a sign. We are here for you. Yes, we are here for you. Let your breath, let your breath come from heaven. Fill our hearts with your life. We are here for you. Yes, we are here for you. To you, our hearts. To you, our hearts are open. Nothing here is sitting. You are one desire. You alone are holy. Only you are worthy, God. Let your fire fall down. Let us shout. Let our shouts be your anthem. Your renown fill the sky. We are here for you. Yes, we are here for you. Let your word move in power. Let your word move in power. Let what's dead come back to life. We are here for you. Yes, we are here for you. Sing to you our hearts. To you our hearts are open. Nothing here is hidden. You are one desire. You alone are holy. Only you are worthy. God, let your fire fall down. Sing to you our hearts. To you our hearts are open. Welcome you. We welcome you with praise. We welcome you with praise. Almighty God of love, we welcome in this place. We welcome you with praise. We welcome you with praise. Almighty God of love, we welcome in this place. Let every heart adore. Let every soul awake. Almighty God of love, we welcome in this place and we welcome you with praise we welcome you with praise almighty god of love we welcome in this place oh that's our song be welcome here be welcome wherever we worship god To your hearts. To you, our hearts are open. Nothing here is hidden. You are one desire. You alone are holy. Only you are worthy. God, let your fire fall down. Hey folks, welcome to Grace Christian Fellowship Online. My name is Drew Bunker and I wanted to thank you for uh, tuning in with us today. Uh, we hope this service is encouraging to you. We hope it uh, uplifts you and builds your faith. We know through scripture one of the ways to build our faith is through tithes and offerings. It's the one part in scripture where God says test me in this. a moment ago I'm here at home and uh, my dog Ollie was running around and it kind of got me thinking about something that we want to share with you as well that here at Grace Christian Fellowship we're reaching four key areas that we are striving to uh, reach through God's love first being 
our local GCF neighborhood, our local politicians, people we come in contact with every day, and the Jewish community. For those of you who are new, and for some of you members, this might be a refresher, but here at Grace, we want to reach out specifically focusing our efforts in God's love on those four areas. And as a part of these crazy times, I want to encourage you to reach out to your neighbors, reach out to your friends, your families, your loved ones, and just let them know you're thinking about them in this time of chaos. And it's so easy just to pick up the phone and say, hey, I love you. We want to encourage you to maintain and build those relationships in this time. And I'm excited to hear what the pastor is going to bring forth in the Word today. I pray that it would be encouraging and you would be built up as well. Thanks. Good morning. And I thank Jason Pascal for filming this. By the way, we are keeping our distance. He is at least seven feet. Now he's eight feet from me. Okay, good. Good. So... Uh, I got a few texts, uh, texts about, uh, the people want to know about Marty Spilkes and how he's doing cooped up in, in his uh, house. I said he's doing quite well, quite well. But when I talked to Marty, he told me a story about his cousin Michael. And Michael, is, he has so much time on his hand, he's building a, a, a different kind of a car. He took a, an engine from a Ford, a transmission from a Chevy, a... Um, exhaust system from a Cadillac, and from a Buick, he got the tires. And I said, Marty, what did he get? And he said, he got five years for theft. Isn't that something? Quite a character, that Spilkes family is something else. <clears throat> so I've got a Hebrew word for you, and the Hebrew word is dodo, D-O-D-O. -O. Now, you may want to call your wife a dodo, or you may not want to call your wife a dodo. Because what, is it, what does a dodo mean? It means beloved. So it's, you could say, my beloved. Or you could say in Hebrew, my dodo. But you better let her know you're using the word Hebrew or you could be in trouble. Oh, well, enough of this. You know, I sought the Lord about what to speak about uh, because of this Corona-19 virus. And Psalm 91 keeps on coming to mind, just like a bunch of other pastors uh, they seem to be talking about Psalm 91 also. And after this message, I'd like you to read all of Psalm 91. And it's not a big deal. We're only talking about 16 verses. And while reading those verses, I want you to notice there are benefits, real benefits for abiding in, the, in Messiah and trusting him, such as in Psalm 91, we read there's the benefit of being saved from what the Bible calls the fowler's snare which is a term that describes catching birds. And uh, this means God can save us from the traps of bad people or save us from terrible dangers of life. Another benefit, a great benefit, is the possibility of being physically or even mentally healed or saved from all kinds of diseases. Diseases, even from the, uh, the coronavirus. And I say possibility because although God can heal all diseases, he sometimes chooses not to heal for his good reason. And I wish I knew why he doesn't heal sometimes and he heals other times. Because of this virus, many people are fearful, even many within the body of Messiah. And this really bothers me. It bothers me because there's a great difference between being concerned and being fearful. And as a believer, you need to be aware that your fear will cause you to lose your focus on Yeshua, who is God manifest in the flesh, and the author and finisher of our faith. And if you're feeling fear, it might be an indication that you're not trusting in Yeshua like you should. And remember, he's the one who has all authority in heaven and on earth. You see, when we are feeling fear, we tend to make decisions based on our emotion and not on the truth of the Word of God. It also might mean that you need to draw closer to God to receive the peace that comes from Him. It's a special peace that passes all understanding. Consider the law of focus. The law of focus has different meanings. 
But my definition is because of how we're wired, we can only focus on one thing at a time. We can't focus on any object that and its background at the same time. For instance, I take my finger like this, and about <clears throat> in about uh, 12 inches, I put my other finger up and a little bit behind the first finger. We'll call the first finger the Jesus finger, and I, I'm focusing on my Jesus finger. And I, my other finger is blurry. It's out of focus. And if I focus on the other finger and my Jesus finger goes out of focus. That's what I call the law of focus. We can't focus on an object and its background at the same time. The bottom line to this message is verse 14 of Psalm, of Psalm 91. The Lord says, if you love me, if, that's a big if, if you love me and truly know who I am, I will rescue you and keep you safe. Now that comes out of the contemporary English version. It's a paraphrased version. And the question is this. Are you loving the Lord through this terrible time, through this virus? It's a pandemic. Have you lost your focus on him? Are you watching so much news you can't focus on Jesus anymore? I'd like you to read Psalm 91 and then listen to what the Holy Spirit has to say to you. And if you need to refocus, ask God's forgiveness, and you refocus. You refocus. Let's pray. Heavenly Father, I thank you for being active in our lives and caring for us and loving us. And God, I pray that we're safe. And if we need to be healed, that you would heal us. May the Lord bless you and keep you. May the Lord make his face shine upon you and be gracious to you. May the Lord lift his countenance upon you and give you peace. Peace in the name of Yeshua, the name above all names. Amen. All right. Welcome back, everyone. That was a great word. I uh, got a couple more songs to close out the uh, online service this morning. And your blood is healing. Your blood is healing in every wound. Your blood is making all things new. Your blood speaks a better word. The measure of my worth. Your blood. It's the measure of my worth, your blood. It's more than I deserve, your blood. Speaks a better word, speaks a better word. It's singing, it's singing out with life. It's shouting down the line. It echoes through the night. The precious blood of Christ speaks a better word. Speaks a better word. Your blood, a robe of righteousness. Your blood, my hope and my defense. Your blood forever covers me. Oh, forever covers me. It's singing out. It's singing out with life. Oh, it's shouting down the lies. It echoes through the night. The precious blood of Christ. Sing a better word. It speaks a better word. It's calling. It's calling out my name. It's breaking every chain. It's making all things right. The precious blood of Christ speaks a better word. Speaks a better word.
it's rewriting. It's rewriting my history. And he covers me with destiny. It's making all things right. The precious blood of Christ. It's rewriting my history. It covers me with destiny. It's making all things right. The precious blood of Christ. It's rewriting my history. And he covers me with destiny. It's making all things right. The precious blood of Christ. It's singing. It's singing out with life. It's shouting down the lies. It echoes through the night. The precious blood of Christ speaks a better word. It speaks a better word. It's calling. It's calling out my name. It's breaking every chain. It's making all things right. The precious blood of Christ speaks a better word. It speaks a better word. And it's rewriting. It's rewriting my history. It covers me with destiny. It's making all things right. The precious blood of Christ. Senor, you're with me. with me what can separate us you are for me so what can stand against us your love it won't let go i know it won't darkness shadows they have no power over me fear is empty shame has no authority your love it thoughts your plans for me are good i know you hold my future and my hope your promises never fail your promises never fail sin healing and freedom healing and freedom as you speak favor over me faith is Breaking all impossibility, your name has overcome, your name alone. I know, I know, your thoughts, your plans for me are good. I know that you hold my future and my hope. Your promises never fail, your promises never fail. Your promises never fail. Your promises never fail. Saying, I am standing. I am standing on every promise that you make. I will see it come to pass in your name, in your name. Jesus, I will trust every word I hear you say. I will see it come to pass in your name, in your name. I am. I am standing on every promise that you make. I will see it come to pass in your name, in your name. In Jesus, I will trust every word I hear you say. I will see it come to pass in your name, in your name. I will see come to pass in your name, in your name. Sin, 
I know your thoughts. I know your thoughts. Your plans for me are good. And I know that you hold my future and my hope. Your promises never fail. Your promises never fail. Your promises never fail. Your promises, see that out. Your promises never. Your promises never fail. Your promises never fail. Your promises never fail. Your promises never fail. See, I'm standing. I am standing on every promise that you make. I will see it come to pass. I will trust every word I hear you say. I will see it come to pass in your name, in your name. I will see it come to pass in your name, in your name. I will see it come to pass in your name, in your one more song here. I just encourage you guys to uh, to worship like you do at church. You know, if you're in your living room or somewhere else, it's a different setting. Uh, it's an also an opportunity to maybe uh, get out of your comfort zone a little bit. Uh, we're out of our comfort zone right now. Pretty much everybody is, but that doesn't mean that God isn't worthy. He's uh, the most worthy. So even through all this, it's even a uh, reason to worship him more. How great. How great the chasm that lay between us. How high the mountain that I could not climb. In desperation, I turned to heaven and spoke your name into the night. Through the darkness, your love and kindness tore through the shadows of my soul. The work is finished, the end is written. Jesus Christ, my living hope. See, who could imagine? So great a mercy, what heart could fathom such boundless grace. The God of ages stepped down from glory to wear my sin and bear my shame. The cross, the cross has spoken, I am forgiven. calls me his own beautiful savior i'm yours forever jesus christ my living hope let's all sing hallelujah hallelujah praise the one who set me free hallelujah Death has lost its grip on me. You have broken every chain. There's salvation in your name, Jesus Christ, my living hope. Then came the morning that sealed the promise. Your buried body began to breathe and out of the silence a roaring lion declared the grave has no claim on me let's sing that again then came the morning then came the morning that sealed the promise your very body
One more time, hallelujah. Hallelujah. Praise the one who set me free. Hallelujah. Death has lost its grip on me. You have broken every chain. This salvation in your name, Jesus Christ, my living hope. Jesus Christ. Christ, my Lord. 